everybody, we're nearly at the end of our second week. Um, just a few things that I want to remind everyone about. Firstly, next week is going to be our themed week for Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. If you haven't managed to get your slips in today, then please send them in first thing on Monday morning and we should still be able to make um, an order up for your child if they want to have the special menu, which is going to be on Thursday. Just to clarify as well, that the burgers, they are the red meal, and the Augustus Gloop soup, which is the vegetarian option, and is going to be um, corn pieces with noodles and a chunky soup, that is the green option for the children on the Thursday. Remember children, all next week, have a look underneath your plates and see if you can find a golden ticket, because if you can, you'll get a bar of chocolate as well. So that's the first thing to remind everyone about. Um, we have got a big bird watch coming up, as you may know. That's going to start on Friday the 21st and run until Friday the 28th. The Year 3 and 4 children have, um, as their community link, the RSPB. So they're going to be really, really looking out to see what birds they can spot around the school. And if you'd like to support us at home, that would be wonderful. If you just log on to the RSPB site, you'll be able to download your own tick sheet and you can record all the birds that you see in your garden over that week. We hope that all children get involved with that. We've got letters going out tonight regarding the parents' evening. Again, just to remind you that this year, so that we minimise the numbers, it's going to be that year groups have specific nights within the week of parents' evening for parents to attend. And we are respectfully asking that you don't bring with you um, siblings or even the children this time. It's not necessary. It's just a meeting between yourselves and the class teachers. We've also put on the letter that if you can ensure you do a lateral flow test before you attend the academy that day. And also please ensure that you wear masks unless you're medically exempt. We've got an awful lot of COVID cases around the academy at the moment and it's not surprising with the new information saying that a positive on a lateral flow now no longer needs the confirmatory PCR test, there seem to be even more cases. I am putting a letter on the website after we've done this blog so that you can read through. It has been sent to us by the Wakefield Local Authority. Um, and it is requesting that because of the high numbers that we're getting through and certainly in two of our areas and that's Mr Morell's class and the early years which is nursery and reception because of the high numbers that we've got in those classes at the moment uh, it would suggest that testing all children on a daily basis with an LFT would be a sensible option again this is up to parents whether you wish a child to do that but certainly we need to inform you that we have had quite a few high cases. It's not just our school, it is borough wide, and this is just because of the high community transition that we've got at the moment. So please just be mindful that children, if they've got any symptoms that are under the COVID listing, so that's the temperatures, um, the loss of sense of smell or taste, the coughing, and the one that was also coming through quite a lot at the moment, which is headaches in our children, are also beginning to become a symptom of COVID. If your child has got any of these symptoms, please try to book them on for a PCR test. Um, they are saying that that is what we need to be doing. And obviously, we've explained before that if you've got anybody in the family who is positive, that doesn't mean that your child can't come to school. Obviously, a positive child can't come to school, but siblings can still come to school but they have to have daily lateral flow testing in the morning before they come and that needs to be negative okay so please have a read of that um stay safe everybody and see you next week bye